Hey everyone, and welcome back to episode 15 of Lots of Giants. Wolfgang is a batshit crazy. <laughs> Last episode, Dark Sword hype, butchering tall birds, good stuff, trying to farm up nightmare fuel so I can just spam the Dark Swords because Dark Swords. Let me just harvest your eggs so they start growing back, I guess. Hey, there's a nightmare. Here, let me, uh, let me Dark Sword you. Because, you know, forehead kill and everything. And I'll kill you too as well. So, I've made it a mission to start using the green caps to clear them out of my inventory. So, like, once I kill this guy and I... I, I might not go completely sane. No. Once I kill the next one and then I go over the sanity threshold, which is a terror beak. My terror beak. I will use the green cap to throw me back instantly. And we'll just start farming up nightmares this way. Excellent. Down you go, sir. And see, now we're at 40. So, now we're at zero. <laughs> and look, another terror beak. Right off the start. Right off the bat. Good, good stuff. Well played. Continue to down all mine enemies. I am using the Dark Sword. I should be using the Spear because I'm trying to get that rid of that. I'm just having too much fun killing things with my Dark Sword, though. Back to being crazy. And look at that, a Terabeak spawn right away. This is what I want to see. Then I want to use my Tentacle Spike to break another weapon. I mean, I can drop it on the ground and leave him here because. Oh, he despawned! Because, well, you know, we're always bringing stuff over here to kill enemies with. Why don't I do this? You know, I have a campfire in your guys' home and all. Let me just cook one of your friends in front of you. <laughs> oh, God. It's so cruel. It's so cruel. It feels good, man. I hate tall birds. Kill tall birds. Kill the tall birds. Let's cook another one of his friends up, because Wolfgang's hungry. Wolfgang's not at max mighty. Wolfgang's at max mighty now. He's happy. I'll cook this up, leave it on the ground, and then, like, we can just pick it up as we need to. And I'll kill this man. I mean, I guess he's not really a man, but I mean, I'll kill him. Do you spawn in those rocks? I can't spawn in rocks. How can you do this? So, down with the nightmare creatures. And he's dead, and we're still below the sanity threshold, and we're approaching 20 nightmare fuel. Okay. <laughs> cool. So we need 5 to 1 for nightmare fuel to... Oh, for, for nightmare fuel to dark sword ratio here. Oh, oh, two hits there. Nice. Okay, you're dead. And before you despawn, uh, let me hit you. Go crazy and keep you in play. Ah, I held up too long. Keep you in play. One more green cap use. Oh, sweet. One more green cap to use. And then that's another inventory slot filled. We're about to break this poopy spear. Excellent. We'll probably finish it on some tall birds here shortly. And you're all but dead. Oh, oh, Talbert, or Talbert, Terbeek! <laughs> Hit him, go back to being crazy so he doesn't go away. And again, that doesn't always stop them from disappearing, sadly. Ooh, I welcome more of you guys. The more the merrier, the more things to kill. Oh, that, I was gonna say, that might hit me. That was a bad spawn on his behalf. Well, a good spawn, I guess, on his behalf. So kill, kill. Terbeek's closer to being dead, I think. Terabeek's dead, and can I kill you before I go back to being... Oh, yes I can. Before I'm too sane. Uh, let's pop the Dark Sword on. <laughs> to, to continue, I might as well keep picking up the Nightmare Fuel. So, Tallbirds. Uh, let me pick up the egg. Oh, apparently it stopped. Let me pick up the eggs, and I can drop them. And that way they start spawning again, because they spawn like every three or four days or something like that. Okay, you shouldn't attack me. I'm not crazy yet. Let me break this over your head. Okay, who wants who wants to be the, who's the challenger? Who's the unlucky fellow? You? Well, you screwed up. Now you messed up. I got five, four, three. So this thing's about to go. I might be able to kill him before it breaks. Yeah. Okay, so I can get another swing off on the on a tall bird. That should go. Ah. Okay, thing's gone. And back to the crappy tentacle spikes. That's an inventory slot freed up. Okay, let's hit twice this time. I wasn't <laughs> paying as much attention as I should have. Freeze up an inventory slot for food. Cool beans. And oof, really close to being crazy enough to kill you. So, pick up them eggies, because tall birds love it when you steal their children in front of them. Just look at this, col look at this collection of babbies. Look at this collection of babbies. This series has quickly turned to how many times can I harass a tall bird? <laughs> the tallbird population just destroy everything they know and love 
Uh, more food for me? Sure, I'll take some grass too. Here, have, have some tall bird eggs. Oh man, you guys are just having a rough day. It's a rough day in the office. Alright, there's one left alive. And we're crazy, cool. That's what we need. So more nightmare fuel. And that crawling nightmare will probably, yep, start making his way towards me. I welcome the challenge. Huzzah! Still waiting on my bosses to spawn. Oh, you bastard. Cheap shot. Cheap shot right at the end of his little attack. He got me. Oh, now he despawned. What a cheap, cheap ass. Cheapo, cheapskate. Damn it. Look at the maximum cheese. I hate when they do that. Let's do, no, 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 no. Let's, let's do two. The darkness is coming. Bro, the darkness is already here. You are crazy. There we go. And uh, <laughs> I'm probably going to leave some, like a stack of meat behind and try to bring some eggs in its place. Like, I'll, I'll cook up some of this meat leave it on the ground because I can eat it as I wait. So, I can only bring so many eggs at once. <laughs> um, I can't eat all the bacon and eggs. Yeah, I can leave the tentacle spikes here. Yeah, fuck it. Let's leave the tentacle spikes on the ground. And I'll bring the dark sword. Okay, so that lets me pick up a couple more eggies. I can fuel this fire. I can see a bit better in the, in the event that a nightmare comes after me. It's going to be a little bit hard to see if it comes after me from over here, but let me get a log. Or a couple logs. And before it's a terror beacon, it nails me in the head. So I just can't... No, I didn't mean to eat that, but alright. Well, rip tall bird. <laughs> I've got no shortage of it. Alright, now I'll take another one. The bacon and eggs, yeah. i got to cook these up before they go bad. I could cook them up and go back to being sane. Do I need to go, do I need to go sane? Nightmare fuel. Oh, hello. Uh, let, me, let me just kill you. No, oh, get over here. Get over here. Hey, uh, that's my fire. You guys don't want to do that. You guys don't want to do that. Get away from my fire. Yeah, that's right. I didn't kite that one very well, now did I? <laughs> Let's make you miss. Up, make an egg, and of course he hits me. Of course he hits me. What a dick. Let me go over to this campfire so I can see. What a jerk my campfire. Okay. Okay, now I can see. Alright, you sir, you were so dead. I was gonna eat my bacon and eggs to outheal you, but then you hit me in the face. Okay, bacon and eggs, fix my boo-boos, and yeah, I'll just finish you too. That throws me over a sanity threshold. I guess I might go I'm, I guess I might go sane in interest of carrying things back. Oh, that's right, he's gonna stop. So yeah, let's go sane for a little bit. Carry some things. I need to start like dropping the stuff off. I need to like deposit my my spoils, <laughs> my loot. So that'll also maybe let me finish. It? Maybe no, I probably won't be able to empty an inventory slot. But man, it feels really good not hearing that audio. I'm sorry. It does it does get to be a bit much after you're crazy for an extended period of time. More nightmare fuel. Oh my god. I've got so much nightmare fuel. <laughs> it's great. Where did a morsel come from? What happened over here? What? Where'd the morsel come from? Sure, let's 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 do that. Let me put this in one so I can swap between it regularly. Uh, Tam here, shovel. Yeah, sho no shovel right there. All right, so something like that. The bacon and eggs is a waste to let. Uh, I don't want to let it go so I don't heal off of it. And now this way I can carry an egg in my hand. Yes, of course, there's still eggs behind, but let me take as many eggs as I can home, and we can even throw together some bacon and eggs. We're back to being sane. That's nice. Uh, rain, not cool, but we're back to being sane, and I have eggs to work with. Can I throw an egg to the wormhole? <laughs> oh, I could go bring all the eggs and just, like, toss them to the wormhole and make little, like, little egg trips. That's great. So, let me get that egg. And, of course, I don't want to wield the dark sword at all times, because otherwise I would just be going crazy. So... That's why I'm holding the axe. If, you know, the Mactus decided to cooperate, I'd have a walking cane in my hands. But he, uh, he didn't play nice. Let's see how many frogs we have, though. Because I can't wait to see a Berger ground pound the living hell out of them. Or even Deerclops. He wouldn't eat the food. He would just kill him. Maybe Deerclops is preferred. Yeah, he's got a good AoE. It would work. Berger's just more dramatic, I guess. <laughs> Bear just just dramatic with his ground pound. That's quite quite fun to watch. So we're tad hurt. I think I have some glands at home. I am obviously going to be eating bacon and eggs, so I'll fix that up. 
And hey, once summer rolls around, we're gonna we're gonna get cactus flowers. I could use jerky to heal up too, just to make use of it. Not a bad idea. All right, so eggies, let's just drop you guys off here because I need inventory space. <laughs> so do I have any glands? Maybe to get rid of. We can go hug some spooters into oblivion if I want to. Let's eat a jerky that's starting to go bad first. It's a, it's a hunger waste, yes. But I clearly have a surplus. And it's it's nice to be back on you know, good, good terms with my health here. So I'll take the meat that's going bad first. Split the stack, because I don't remember how many we have over here. Now let's start harvesting the jerky. Um, spooters, yeah, I should pay them. Eh, maybe not. I don't think I really need to... I don't really need to pay the spooters any visit. We'll, we'll leave them go. We'll let them tier 3. I should do a cactus run, though. Cactus run's a good idea. Rain is pouring down, and maybe I'll just start making dark swords and leaving them in my base. The whole tooth trap farm, still not a bad idea for the walls, just as extra protection if something were to really go down. Uh, like, say I died for some reason, and the touchstone back, and you know, had a hound attack. Well, I'm not going to punch them to death. It wouldn't be very graceful. It's possible, but it's not very graceful. Um, yeah, just having that there as an option would be cool. But a cactus run is definitely in order. Just to, it took a lot of cactus to again to get me back over that sanity threshold because we were we were crazy for a very extended period of time. It was a very it was a very uh, productive period of time, mind you. But we were crazy. Um, finish this up, put the meat in the ice box, and we don't have any more bacon and eggs in there. So I'm gonna have to make a whole whole stack. Just, no, a whole batch of bacon things. do a whole five thing here with all my crock pots that I have available to me. I'll wear the umbrella now just so we stop getting so wet. Uh, let's see, we're day 50. Yeah, we're, we're, we're getting in there. Um, eight days too. Eight days till summer. Flingo's on, or Flingo's there. Flingo will cover everything. Summer shouldn't be too big of a concern. I should, however, be harvesting as much gra or as many grass and twigs as I can. Because I am going through them quite a bit. Cactus, by the way, is going stale. Wouldn't be a bad idea to leave it behind and get a fresh stack. Though so cooking it, you know, just brings it back up. Alright, so that is the last of my grass and twigs that need harvested. Pause that off. Do I want to do more drying racks? Uh, <laughs> I don't know, maybe? I mean, I'm using the stuff that I have. Wouldn't be a bad idea. Just finish this. Oh, I'm gonna need one more, aren't I? Son of a bitch. It was 16, not 15. I didn't, I didn't count them beforehand. I just kind of like, you know, guessed. I split the stack. Well then, here we go. I can math. There you go. All right, so you're full. Uh, let's put this in here. Dude, how many stacks of dirt do I have? Oh my days. <laughs> let's just turn you into bacon. Or let's just turn you into eggs because that's monster meat at this point. Yeah, I can use it. I can use it for bacon. Oh, I didn't cook it. I can use it for bacon and eggs, or yeah, I can use like a tall bird egg and some twigs. But like, I've got so much regular meat that it's not a concern. So, in the interest of using these eggs before something silly happens to them, let's actually add them to the recipes. So, do that. I can't do two twigs with a, with a regular tall bird egg, right? It's always gonna be wet. Oop. Okay. I kind of figured that, and actually, let's use the jerky, because if a jerky's, if jerky's going bad, it's a hound attack. If jerky's going bad, that's a, it's worse than regular meat going bad. Um, I could do a couple tooth traps, I guess, really quick. It ain't, it ain't, it ain't a bad idea. Just to help me out. Mm, it's a one to one here. We'll do five, because I'm not going to be able to get many down. Where do I want to put it? Just up here. Anything up here? We have dark swords. Yeah, they're gonna get wrecked. All right. Oh, I've not prototyped them yet. All right, so we're just gonna wreck them with dark swords. Let's do a regular fire. I don't want to be at base. Or, I'm sorry, a regular campfire. Yep, so as they come after me, they will get destroyed. And I will cook these up because this will get me back to being mighty. Come on, and go, 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 go. Add a damage. Yep. <laughs> Should be a two-hit kill. <laughs> this might even be a one-hit. <laughs> Wolfgang, I love you, sir. You are quite the fun character to play with a tall bird fortress in a world. Anybody else? Anybody else want some? Anybody else want some? 
Wish I had a walking cane right about now. Tell me that's not it. Aw, oh, man. Oh, Wolfgang was just getting started. Wolfgang don't fuck around. <laughs> Let's go home. I really expected more hounds. Uh, I, I will be honest with you there. I fully expected more. So, a cactus run in the morning. That's, that's, that's the thing. Let's get home. Uh, I will put logs rather than twigs or anything on the fire. Okay, where my football helmet? And, yep, bacon eggs are good to go. Uh, again, yeah, just save the meat. So, uh, let me pick up as many of these. I'm not, I'm not sure how I feel about science. <laughs> nice quote. So, you can have that and... No, no, open the crock pot. So, two, a twig. I love how you can use a twig with a tall bird egg. That filler. That f that's excellent. Good, 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 good stuff. There you go. Have a tall bird egg. And one more tall bird egg hype. There you are. Okay, a cactus run again. And I didn't mean I don't need I'll need all those. Let me prototype this so I know how. Also it's free sanity, so that's nice. Now, logs. We have no shortage up north, so I think we're gonna go up north, get some logs. And let's make that batch of dark swords. Let me make them over here, because they'll probably start falling on the ground. Mm -mm -mm. Dark swords. So we still need five more nightmare fuel to make the maximum use of it. But there we go. Thar be dark swords. Thar they be. <laughs> This can stay on the ground and won't, nothing will happen to it with a flingo covering it. That living log, that is. Alright, bacon and eggs. I'm good for the trip. I don't even need to use the, the berries as filler for anything anymore. So, rope. We'll actually be limiting here. So, let's make some rope. And yeah, I mean, the only reason I ever make or want to have to be trapped is it's, it's like a, a desperation kind of thing. Like, maybe somehow, some way. Shit really hit the fan. Well, why not just have it down? Okay, I will go get my logs up north, but because I'm just going to be making 13, let me just chop a couple trees down. I need to put, to be honest with you, I need to push these away a little bit so they, when they catch on fire in summer, they don't push towards my base. They really shouldn't because the, the birdcage isn't flammable, but it's not something I want to, I don't want to mess around with right now. If I could just click on the, you know, the center, that'd be great. <laughs> All right, let's stump them, and let's get this cactus picked up. It's not, yeah, it's not even a bad idea to get them away from the cactus. Oh, you know what? They're all like tier three for the vast majority of them. Let's just have some fun. Just don't come towards my base, or we're screwed. Because it has, like, it has a, it's, it's uncontrollable. It goes wherever. So there you go. Break my trees. Tree guard. Hey, buddy. Hey, more dark swords. Uh, please don't come towards my base. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh, come on, stay awake! Okay, we're good. This thing's fun, but it's a little volatile. Alright, you, you don't worry about your mighty belly, bro. You're gonna you're gonna kick that tree guard's ass here in a second, man. <laughs> um, I still need to do a cactus run. Let me not forget about this. Now, you're a huge tree guard. The problem with that is you have loads of HP. I think I may take you to the bishop, just to let you kill the bishop for me, and then I'll finish you off myself. Alright, so I've got all the logs I need, and I realize I have a bajillion logs up north. I just kind of want to get rid of all this. The beauty of that weather pane, I've got to say, it stumps the trees. It stumps the trees. No, no, uh, no shovel needed. Look how many is there. Are there pains are fun. Uh, I guess I'll take a morsel. That's a failure. I killed a bird, I guess. <laughs> Alright, rip all you, and you guys are away from the cactus enough that it really shouldn't end up causing an issue. Uh, this can end up being, like, for the burn chest, you know? We'll, we'll, we'll burn all that. Logs? Sure, I've got a surplus now. There you go, I'll go pick up what's on the ground. Wolfgang will be going mighty here very shortly with this tree guard. Need to pick up the stuff that's near the cactus, cause, again, it's flammable. I don't want it to spread to the cactus. I don't think cactus will combust during summer, but I know you can burn it. Okay, you sir, come up here. Um, let me move my shovel over here. And I have the helmet on. I do want to start getting cactus. So, just I just want to bring you up here and let you get killed. And well, take some damage for me. Cool. I could catch up on fire using my uh, <laughs> my scale mail. 
Or, I mean, I guess I could just do this. Hey, buddy. Oh, it's on fire. He might be wet. Oh, he's wet. <laughs> so he won't catch on fire. Lucky bastard. More grass is necessary. Do all the stuff we've been doing. And there'll be a bishop here, and bishops get pissy real easy. Is there two? Yes. There's actually a lot of these guys left over still. He should walk straight up through the center, because he aggroes to me from a very far range. And he should get hit by that bishop, which I would then assume he'll hit the, he'll hit the bishop, and then the other clockwork guys will join in. Let's see if this pans out. That's panning out. That's panning out. Yeah, he'll kill him, and there's my purple gems. There's some gears, too. Hell, I'll pick up the gears. Let's make that ice box. Let's have that pre-made. I need rocks, and I got I got some at home. All right. <laughs> He's destroyed all the stuff for me. Okay, these things make me go crazy. Let's get rid of them. There you go. If he catches on fire by proxy, so be it. So be it. There you go, buddy. You know you like it. The thing is, he's wet, so he's really not gonna... He's not likely to catch on fire, no matter how hard... Oh, okay, well, I'll be... <laughs> I'm a liar, okay. Works for me, man. How's that feel? Hurts, doesn't it? Let me get rid of this evil flower, too. Alright, hey, buddy. I will punch you. With a dark sword. Because that's what punching is. So, one, two, three, four. Wish I had a walking cane so I could do that and go back and forth. Oh, no, that's, that's Tilde. And that, that gets me hit. Let me, let me get rid of that. I, I wanted to go press one. One, two, three, four. And, okay. One, two. Oh, what, why is F? Why did F stop? That was weird. Okay. I'm too close. I might get hit on that one. Yeah. Oh, I got him before he could get the swing off. Get bent. Get bent, sir. Okay. Got more living logs. Cool, cool, cool. So, I got gears, I got purple gems. I don't need the purple gems, actually. But uh, I got purple gems. And I'm going to go get some rocks. Pre-craft a icebox. An icebox, yeah. I, I, I don't know, man. I think I'm having too much fun with Wolfgang now. Why are you here? Are you... <gasps> Did you eat a cactus? Is that a thing? How dare you? Wolfgang smash. Wolfgang smash. Wolfgang not even mighty. Wolfgang smash. You took a cactus. You son of a... You're... No. You're done. You're done now. Uh, let's put that on before I harvest that. That would be, that would be silly otherwise. Bacon and eggs is mighty. Also heals me. Nice. And here you go. So, put my helmet back on. Put you up there. Alright, grass. Move some things around. Alright, so I still want to go put the tooth traps down. That's my carrying all this stuff. Uh, I do want the stone. One, two, three. Refine and ice box. I could put a crock pot over there, but I really don't need it. I think I just need to put an ice box. Just to extend the life of the food that's over there. And there's food on the ground that I'm not even able to use right now. But having it pre-crafted is pretty cool. Extra living logs can go there. Oh, no, no, right here, right here. <laughs> so we just need to get more nightmare fuel. But I think that's enough dark swords to last us for as long as we're going to end up being in this world. Sadly. Just, yeah. I got so many gears! Oh my god, WX Heaven! WX Heaven. Has the grass and twigs grown back yet? No, they have not. Darn. Uh, let's move... Oh. Okay, I want my... Okay, I want my fo football helmet over there. We're the Tam Enchanter. Uh, we're not trying to go crazy right now. There's no point in that. And this football helmet... What's... <gasps> Dragonfly! He fly! He fly! Hey, buddy. Alright, now that you're coming, let me, uh... Just sandy up. I get a couple things of sandy restoration going. Did I hear a bear during there? Let me listen. Yes. There is a bearger and a D fly right there. So, I will not go to my endos. I will actually go over here. Uh, in interest or in hopes of maybe them breaking down or burning. Some of the evil flowers, just to get rid of them. I don't. I, I mean, I could harvest them for nightmare fuel, but I need to get five, and it's a crappy ratio. It's not a, not a good idea. I don't. I don't think. I might as well just top my sanity off. And they're gonna duke it out, unless there's a third boss. So I'm hearing a deer. I'm hearing a badger, and I'm hearing D fly. I don't. Hear, I don't hear deer claps, and I don't hear moosey. I would welcome deer claps. 
Okay, there he is. He's over here. Yep. They both spawn in the same spot. Okay, they're, they're gonna duke it out here. And they're gonna break all the marble stuff, which is excellent, actually. I will wear the 32 percenter. Go ahead, ground pound. I want you to break all this stuff. Ground pound, please. <laughs> He's just dancing this time. Last time he did a whole lot more swinging and ground pounding. It, it looked like he was in the middle of a ground pound animation there, but it got cancelled. I think he's going to lose this one this time. Unless he does more ground pound, that's where his damage comes from. DeFi's damage comes from ground pounds too. Both of those attacks do so much damage. Don't run towards my base, please. I, I will I will intervene if necessary. Ooh. Ooh. DeFi's looking... maybe... Dragonfly lost last time. Ooh. Ooh. Ground pound, bear to do it. There you go, you got this. Well, you had this. He, he's not as hurt as last time. He didn't get one hit. He, he, yeah, Dragonfly definitely didn't do as much this time around. But there you go. <laughs> Interesting that that's the same thing we got before. So there's some scales. There is uh, some more thick first. That's a hibernation vest and the... Uh, Insula er, the insulation pack, and then this is scale mail, and then the other thing, the, the actual chest. Alright then. So, I want all of this. Let me take this home first. I can come back for my cactus. I need to put the damn tooth traps down. Get out of my inventory. <laughs> so much stuff is going on. I fucking love it. But there's some bosses. We, it's been a little bit. Sadly, they kill each other. I mean, I, w I almost wish they would spawn in waves to make it more more annoying. It's like, one comes after you and as soon as you think you're done. Hello, I'm Berger. <laughs> oh, well, hello, Berger. I have to kill Berger. So we'll make a scaled chest and we'll put our boss items in that. I'll go up and get my cactus back. And, of course, I can pick cactus with this poopy helmet. Sweet. And I'll start putting down my uh, tooth traps. So the tooth traps, I kind of wanted close to the endos, but the more I think about it, the more I think it's a bad idea because if I rely on it for whatever reason, which really shouldn't, it's just a, it's an emergency thing. And a bear or deer clops is there. They're pretty likely to break both endos, and that that's like a dragonfly deterrent over there. So I, I don't want that. I think I might just instead put them right here. So I'll pick these up, pick that up, more meat. I can't use all the food that I've been getting. So tooth traps. I really don't think I'm going to worry about them sliding too much. Maybe I will. <laughs> Maybe I will. Let me just put them down as I as I create them. And I can only make 11 with the amount of rope I have, so it's that's no biggie. There you go. That's not the most efficient placing placement, but I want to space them out a tad more in the interest of giving them more time as an enemy travels over them to, like, reset. Because sometimes, like, they don't always trigger them. Maybe that'll help. I don't know. I don't know. So, how many more I can do? Five. Okie doke. There you are, sir. There you are. I'll just look a line to walk Berger through it or something. You know? Why not? That'll free up an inventory slot. No, no, no. I mean, I might as well keep it going the way I'm going. No, nah, that's too far. <laughs> Lots of giants. Well, I'm not supposed to worry about anything like this, but I do. Okay. Marble. I can make some silly marble flooring. I could heal up with all the butterflies that Berger ever so graciously slaughtered. Good man. Good man. And that's gonna end up that's gonna end up making me go mighty. Where are the umbrella? There's mighty. Where are the umbrella? Let's fix the, the moisture. And I mean I can make a stupid marble suit, which I'm never going to do, because that movement speed penalty. Or I can make some more checkered flooring. Because the checkered flooring uses marble. Sure. I think it's checkered flooring up, but sure. Let's do that. Bring this thing with me here, and all right. So there's a good bit of cactus down yonder. Let's pick that up. But guys, I hate to say it already. It's time to wrap the episode up here. Episode 15, lots of giants. We're getting our bosses again. Feels good, man. And we are, oh, hey, there's more folk goods than I initially thought about. So the Volco population is not gone. That's good to know. Double weeds and rope. Oh my god, all the tooth traps and stuff, and I wasn't expecting any of it. I forgot a Dear god, actually, no, I don't think I even explored this. Oh, goodness. The game. The gift that keeps on giving. Thank you, game. But, guys, <laughs> I've got to wrap it up here. Episode 15. Bosses. Bosses. Dark Sword hype. Tooth traps. Cactus everywhere. Very successful Wolfgang run. Thank you, Tallbirds.
Thank you guys all for watching, and I'll see you next time.